To identify Prunus pedus, I'll be looking for relatively smooth grey green bark, slightly patchy, broken up if you look closely by grey or cream coloured lenticels. The flower is distinctive, produced on a long raceme at the end of new growth, it is made up of a head of five petalled white flowers close and densely borne together on the raceme. And the subsequent fruit, the cherries, are born on this raceme, each one on a short stalk, changing from light green through to a purpley black over the season. The leaves born alternate on the twig. The leaf ovate to obovate, so often wider nearer to the tip than to the centre of the leaf. And the leaf margin with lots and lots of fine serrations, the leaf tip often just a short accumulate tip at the end, and a red petiole, again with prunus, the presence of two glands at the top of the petiole near to the leaf lamina is distinctive. And the form of this tree is, quite frankly, erratic. Very mad haircut sort of look with lots of laterals sticking out from the crown, sometimes going two metres out from the main body of the crown in lots of different directions. Winter buds are born singly, so never in the clusters that are present in Prunus avium. A uh, number of visible bud scales, rather bronzy, red-brown in colour, uh, and egg-shaped, ovate, and born alternately on the twig.